Up Wars Friday! Yep. Um, it's Fingerboard Friday today. Um, and today, for this video, I'm going to show you wolves six fingerboard life hacks. What will make fingerboarding a lot easier for you. Um, will make it a lot easier and may even help you with some struggles you have. But, okay, so for this video, I'm gonna use my old tick deck. This one is very scratched on the bottom. Um, the grip tape is not the cleanest. Um, the wheels are a little bit dirty, but we're going to sort that today with this first life hack. Life hack number one. Do you ever, have you ever had not clean wheels and you're just getting really sick and tired of them? Like they're just really dirty? Well, mine are kind of dirty, but they mostly are dirty because it's an old tick Well, all you need to do is grab some tape. Pull the tape out. Basically, stick your fingerboard to it and just go along. Yeah. So basically. That's all you need to do, and since my wheels are not that dirty, you can kind of see dirt on there, and you kind of can't see dirt on there. But, yeah. That's the first life hack, and while I have the tape out, That's um, yeah. while I have the tape out, let's move on to our sick. Our second life hack. Can you please sit still? Um, our second life hack. So what you want to do is get your fingerboard and get your tape. It can be a brand new strip or it can be the strip you use for your wheels. It doesn't really matter. And then what you want to do is turn your fingerboard up this way onto its tracks. Get the tape. and put the tape over the fingerboard push it down hard so you can get all the crevices in the grip tape like this make sure it's all flattened down then get your other end hold the fingerboard down And peel it off and pretty much your wheels and your grip tape are basically back to brand new look at that life hack so yeah Basically, your grip tape and your wheels are all clean. So basically, it's back to brand new, basically. It's basically like a new tech deck. It's here for the scratches on the bottom. Quick pop shove it. Woo! Okay. Life hack number three. Okay. For this life hack, if you have trouble with, like me, 
doing like ollies, like trying to do an ollie without putting your thumb under the board. Um, trying to go like back and forward. Then your solution is a rubber band. <laughs> so all you want to do is flip your tick tick over, stretch the rubber band. Actually, no, nah, not flip it over, but stretch the rubber band. Put that on top, and then put the other one. This one. This is really tricky. But turn it side on basically because that's the easiest way to do it. Turn it side on and put the rubber band like under the trucks. Under the trucks like that. And then put the rubber Come on, put the rubber band like that, and it's basically, are you serious, are you serious right now bro, oh my, oh my lord, okay, hang on, Put one under the truck and then one over the opposite corner truck. So like under here, under, and then hold it down and under that one. Okay, I'm, this is taking too long, so I'm going to cut to the point where I actually get it. Okay, that took a really long time, but I finally got it on. Once you got it on, and it's basically like this, under the trucks, and just gear over top, put your fingers underneath the rubber band. And basically... Basically, it's just, basically just holds down your fingers. Yeah. And your fingers. So, let's go along. Without your thumb under the board. Only two menu. Easy. Now, I presume if you want to put a rubber band on your tick tick, I presume doing like a stripe down the middle of your down the middle of your grip tape so it actually looks like it's so it actually looks like you got um, a line, you got some cuts on your grip tape. So it doesn't look suspicious that you actually have a rubber band on. But that's just, but you can't stick with a rubber band on your tech deck your whole life. You eventually have to progress and do some ollies without the rubber band but um yeah on to hack number four this is hack number four okay now this one's gonna be a little messy 
So, have you ever had wheels that have like a lot of traction and don't really spin that great? Well, if you ever look at mine, there's this one wheel here that just doesn't want to spin at all. Don't worry. Just grab some wax. Some wax. Get your wax. You don't have to get a big chunk like I have. You can get like little pieces. Grab it and rub some wax on your wheel. Rub some wax on your wheels. Like that. They have least traction now. And what it does is it leaves a nice smell behind gonna be back in a seat i'm just getting a cloth It doesn't also make your wheels slipperier and have less traction, but it also leaves a nice smell behind. So yeah, just got a cloth just in case. And I'll put my sp ah, put the spoon, put the spoon. Put your wax um, in a safe place, basically. And if you don't want to get your whole surface um, really slippery, then you can give your wheels a bit of a dab. A bit of a dab to kind of clean, kind of clean them off. Then basically, after you've done that, skate away. They have a lot less traction now, so you can do easier pop shovets, easier ollies, easier any tricks, all because of just some wax from a candle. So, yeah, just clean the board off a little bit, yeah. Okay, on to life hack number four. Do you have a rail like this that just doesn't, that isn't slippery and doesn't grind right? Then look no further, because all you need for this is you need some wax. Just rub it on the rail. Like that.
So yeah. And again, it makes the rail slippery, but it also leaves a really nice smell behind. And if you're wondering what kind of wax I'm using, I'm using um, candle wax. Like, you know those really nice smelling um, candles? Like, like the ones that they do in the store, like the cookies and cream and stuff? Well, I'm using that kind of candle wax that smells like that. And then go up to your rail. So smooth. So smooth. It's such, it's so smooth and so easy. Okay. Now, since you've basically got everything on for our last life hack, for our last life hack, um, I am going to, I am going to show. Life hack number five. Have you ever been bored? Like you don't have any obstacles like this or obstacles like this to play on? Well, well, all you need um, to take deck on is your bathroom sink. Your bathroom sink is basically perfect for a bowl. See, let me show you. See, perfect bowl, just absolutely perfect, perfect, <laughs> it's a perfect bowl. I, ac I accidentally miscounted how many life hacks we did, but that was, that was six life hacks um, to hack your fingerboarding life. Um, so, yeah, hopefully those hacks would have helped you, you wolves, and, oh, whoops. and I will see you wolves in another Fingerboard Friday. And please get me to 100 subscribers because if you do, I'll do a special video for you guys that you that you absolutely like so please come back for another fingerboard friday peace out